Hey guys, what's up? Um, Green Farts here after months. Um, I haven't, first of all, happy May 4th. Uh, it's probably going on May 5th, so Feliz Cinco de Mayo para todos esos mexicanos ahí. Um, yeah, so hi, either happy Cinco de Mayo or um, happy May 4th. May the 4th be with you. Um, anywho. So I literally just recently listened to uh, Family Guy song. It's the Poop Before My Anus Bleeds by uh, Griffin and Quackmire. And it's a really fun song. So I want to show you guys how to play it, considering that I've been saying to this one subscriber that I'll show him how to play a song. And I haven't. I just haven't had the time yet because of uh, school and stuff. But hopefully I can uh, start recording stuff again. Uh, so yeah, I li just take a listen to what this sounds like. Um, I'm a bad singer, and also my electric guitar. I finally got strings for this, so I don't want to plug it in because I don't want to. I just don't want to plug it in. Um, my acoustic, I would use that, but I'm missing a string. So until I get that, I'll start doing those again. So yeah, just take a listen, and then I'll show you how to do it. Um, it's actually not that hard. It's just. Um, it's just five chords, five chords, um, it's not hard. The only thing that would be hard is the strumming pattern. So yeah, take a listen. I can't poop in strange places, I can only poop in my home. It's like I'm walked by strange faces, that's why I never roam. I flex to we with strangers to satisfy my fecal needs. I put my whole family in danger to poop before my inner sleep. Humble, humble, you know just what I need. Okay, assuming that you're back now, or you just skipped, who knows. Um, so the first thing I want to show you is, uh, the first thing I want to show you is uh, the strumming pattern. So first of all, the strumming pattern is just going to go. So every time you hear the, the pick, hit the strings, like that, you know. So I'll go really slow. So it's down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down. So if you were to play that. So that's what it would sound like. Now the chords are really easy. Um, I'll show a picture here if I can. Um, I'll also show you how to play it here. So let me just, okay, that's about as close as I can get it. So first chord that we're going to start with is going to be an A minor. So you're just going to get your index finger, you're going to put it on the first fret of the B string or the second string going up. This song is also an E standard, for guys say that. Okay, next you're going to take your ring finger, put it on the second fret of the G string. And then your middle finger, put it on the second fret of the D string. And you just put that. Okay, so you gotta do that with the strumming pattern. Okay, so yeah, you're just gonna do that. You're gonna do that for two measures. And after the second measure, you're gonna move it to an E. Now an E is the exact same positioning for an A minor. Just get all the fingers and move them up one string. So you're down here, then move them up one string. There's an E. So now when you play it, you just go like this. 
gonna go ahead and move that to a G, which looks like this. Your ring finger on the third fret of the high E string, your index finger on the second fret of the A string, and your middle finger on the third fret of the low E. And that's a G. So if we put them together, we have this. So yeah, that first part is literally just A, E, well, A minor, E, G, and then back to A minor. So that's that first part. And that's that first and second part, really. And then when we get to the chorus, when it goes, home ball, home ball, when it gets to that part, that part gets tricky. So you're gonna go from F to C, then G, and then A minor. So it's home ball, home ball. Just what I need. Yeah, so you got that. So to play an F, there's two ways to play an F. You can either play it like kind of like a C, but kind of like a C, but not really. Or you can play it like a bar chord. I prefer the bar chord. Um, it's actually better if you play it like the bar chord because that's the original way to play it. So to do that, you're just gonna get this finger and bar the entire first fret. Okay, now you're gonna get your middle finger and put it on the second fret of the G string and then your ring finger is going to be on the third fret of the A string and your pinky is going to be on the third fret of the D string. There's your F. And you're going to move to a C which all you have to do is just get rid of this well, this finger for now and also get rid of the pinky. You're gonna move your middle finger up one string, your ring finger is gonna stay where it is, and then your index finger is gonna go on the first fret of the B string. And there's a C. So it's actually really easy to transition from this to this. So watch. And then just G and then A minor and you gotta do that part twice so it's home ball, home ball. you know just what I need home ball, home ball. Poop before my anus bleeds and those are the chords um, you can play along with the little thing that I have there showing you how to play. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. You uh, take care. Hopefully I can uh, show you how to play a different song next. Because it's a fun song. It's just fast. It's hard to sing. Yeah, I'll see you guys later. Have you ever put butter on a pop tart? It's so freaking good. Have you ever put butter on a pop tart? If you haven't, then I think you should. I was sitting in the kitchen one day and I was like, fuck.